Now this patient had a PKP one year back and now for the past month he is having blurring of vision as a result of graft failure. So what is the difference between graft failure and graft rejection? Failure is due to endothelial decompensation. So in that case the eye is going to be quiet. Rejection involves an inflammatory element and they can have specific signs like epithelial signs that are called crack mark spots or endothelial signs that includes KPs, edema and inflammation. So what is the treatment of rejection? The mainstay is topical steroids, although periocular injection or systemic immunosuppression may be sometimes necessary. So what are the poor prognostic factors for cornea grafting? Eyelid disease, tear film dysfunction, anterior segment inflammation, corneal vascularization or thinning, and uncontrolled glaucoma. So remember that failure usually happens one to two days post-op and it is usually due to three reasons. Number one is endothelial decompensation. Number two is inadequate tissue preservation. And number three is surgical manipulation.